Uh, Andy Dalton has been named the new starter for the Carolina Panthers, and he'll be under center to take on Vegas. Uh, the Raiders are coming off a massive win. Peter, I go right back to you with the Red Rifle. Yeah, what an interesting week it's been. Yeah. Uh, everyone's pulled their hair out about this, but guess what? On Sunday, Andy Dalton's going to be starting under center, and Bryce Young is far on the sidelines. I think maybe the worst thing for Bryce Young is Andy Dalton goes out there and wins 24-21 to 21 and just has competent football, and all of a sudden you're like, wow, Panthers have other players, and we haven't been able to unleash them. I'm really curious to see how this goes. I don't know if Panthers fans want to see Dalton succeed <laughs> or want to see him fail miserably so that there's some drastic change and Bryce is put back in, but Andy Dalton doesn't usually just, you know, come out there and just, you know, just play badly. Well, what if he does come out and play well and win? But that would mean maybe that they're not the worst organization in the history of sports. It might even mean that Bryce Young is not the best player in the history of sports. This will be – you want to, you want some stories from an 0-2 team, the 32nd-ranked team in the league? This is going to be take mountain if Andy Dalton throws three touchdowns and the Panthers win mm. in Vegas. I'm kind of here for it. Like, there's not a lot of praise and celebration. The Raiders beat the Ravens last week. There you I go, Akbar. To okay. celebrate that. Okay. There's a disturbance in the force, and that disturbance mm -hmm. is the Las Vegas Raiders.